Orientiate Satsugamushi, Wikipedia article audio. Orientiate Satsugamushi is the causative organism of scrub typhus, and the natural vector and reservoir is probably trombiculate mites. The organism is an obligate intracellular pathogen, which must infect eukaryotic cells to multiply. The envelope is similar to that of gram negative bacteria but it is not easily stained with gram stain and the Gimenez stain is preferred. A large number of serotypes are described, these include carp, gilliam, kato, and kawasaki, but enormous variability exists, with eight serotypes being reported in a single field in Malaysia, and many more serotypes continue to be reported. Genetic methods have revealed even greater complexity than had been previously described. Infection with one serotype does not confer immunity to other serotypes. Repeated infection in the same individual is, therefore, possible, and this complicates vaccine design. Microbiology Antimicrobial therapy Vaccine the bacterium was initially categorized in the genus Rickettsia, but is now classed in a separate genus, Orientia, which it shares with the recently described species Orientia Shudo. It is 0.5 m wide and 1.2 to 3.0 m long, and is an obligatory intracellular organism that can only be cultured in cell monolayers. The organism is highly virulent and should only be handled in a laboratory with biosafety level 3 facilities. Otsutsugamushi is sensitive in vitro to doxycycline, rifampicin, and azithromycin. It is innately resistant to all beta-lactam antibiotics because it lacks a classical peptidoglycan cell wall. Aminoglycosides are also ineffective in human infection because the organism is intracellular, and aminoglycosides do not penetrate intracellularly. No licensed scrub typhus vaccines are currently available. Enormous antigenic variation in Orientia Tsutsugamushi strains is now known, and immunity to one strain does not confer immunity to another. Any scrub typhus vaccine should give protection to all the strains present locally, to give an acceptable level of protection. A vaccine developed for one locality may not be protective in another locality, because of antigenic variation. This complexity continues to hamper efforts to produce a viable vaccine.